Okay, hi there. We are back to give you some exciting moment on how to uh, take a way or free yourself from grip, some dangerous grip or a dangerous grip from the neck that hooks your hand and shoulder at the same time along the line. So we'll get to understand the grip as it goes as we get into the business. Okay, but if you are coming into, if you are watching our video for the very first time, I will always like to remind, please do not hesitate to subscribe, hit the bell, and let's have your comment. And for our already subscribers, we appreciate you so much. Thank you. Let's go down to the business. Okay? Um, this is how the grip goes. Now lock it. Okay. Um, some people know about this, but some do not really know about it. Okay, now quick table. Okay. Now where the effectiveness of this lock? Now take it. The effectiveness of this lock comes from his locking my neck throwing me off my neck there and the shoulders locking the shoulders from the back so it is really really uncomfortable all right but now we are going to show us how you can free yourself from this bad situation because this is a bad situation the lock here is not pleasant at all now we're going to show you how to free yourself from it okay now the first thing you need to do, like I said, anytime you are in a self-defense mode, you need to relax your mind. Do not allow your mind to be troubled in whatever you see or whatever decision that comes away. Just relax. Now from here, the first thing, I swing myself to whichever side I decide to like that. Bringing my hand down, I swing, I swing, and then I go this way. Same thing, and I try to throw my hand and lock it. Now, what happens from here? I pull him down and I do it. Now, from here, I can decide to swing or throw him from here or throw him from the back. Okay, let's take that again. He locks. Now, if you want to make it a bit subtle, it's going like this. It's a bit subtle. But if you want to make it to be harsh on him, it's ah. one time. See that? Ah. One time. That's how it goes. Now, from here, he's already free. Now, find a way to there and lock here. Now, from here, you jack him. Or you can swing out. <laughs> Everything is possible if you know the technique. Know the principles, know the technique. Whatever you see is very, very possible. Okay? See that again. <coughs> it locks again. Now I try to make it. A bit harsh on him. I swing immediately. Then I swing. And the next thing, I go here. I swing out. Okay, let me explain further on this particular one. Now from the hook here, hook and here. All right. Now my hand is here on the and I twist my. Now the next thing is I force my leg up in here. I tap the leg, my hand is here, I rotate the head. That's how it goes. No matter what. If you restrict, now restrict when I try to fling you off. Restrict when I try to fling you off. 
Restrict, you lose your neck. So it's better to follow the swing and go down. Okay? I hope we've been able to clear some doubts in that aspect. So now let's get set to take the second move. Okay, now let's see the next way to free yourself from this kind of situation. All right, like I said, you don't need to bother yourself over anything. Just relax your mind. Relax. That is not important. And the next thing you do, in a split second, you are down. Boom! Here, and it comes there. Pop. Let's take this other side. Right? Now from here, same way, relax the show for more clarity. It grabs and locks again. Now the next thing, as I say, you relax your mind and swing down quickly. And I said before that you can use your head. But I want to use the hand so that as I'm striking with the hand, I'm going down. While it comes, I go two. Okay. Let's take that again. Look. I go one, two, three. All right. Now let's go to the next side. Okay, from here, the same way, relax, don't stop yourself over anything. And think, while you are thinking, let me quickly say this. While you are thinking, try to pull your hand down and you go down. And once you go down, like I said, you can see you make use of your head here. But making use of your head here, you will be stressed to get to. That's right. So you go boom here. Then bam. Okay. Okay, let's see the third one. How to free yourself from this dangerous lock from the neck that hooks your your hands and shoulders together. Okay? Now from here, like I said, when you are faced with this, this kind of situation, what you do is do not disturb yourself, relax your mind, and then what you do is take a firm stand. Now what you need to do, you think, take your hand down this way. Now find where his face is, then put your hand ah. across, across, ah. and lock. As you, you, the way you are locking, you are locking and pressing as if you want to press down. Lock. Lock and press down. And lock. How do you feel? What's the effect? I wanted to pull out my hand, but I couldn't. Because the lock goes, clamp his own lock, and he was locking him, clamp it together and make it impossible for him to free himself. So he's in between freeing himself and the pain is facing from the lock here, and also the one that you have actually locked him here. Okay, let's see that. Close there. Take your firm stance. Bring the hand. Locate it. Cross. Lock. Between. Ah. Ah. Yes. And pull down. Mm. Pull. 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 Ah. Pull down. Then you can swing him. Let's take the side view. 
Now oh, that's the lock here. Take your firm stance. Bring your hand down. Come to where you can locate it. Cross your hand. Go straight there. Your one side and this both sides close to the ear and the back of the neck, the side of the back of the neck. So one side is pressing his throat, the other two sides are pressing uh, the back of the neck, uh, like that. Uh, See that? Uh, like that. Then at the same time, here the, your shoulders here are clamping down. Uh, That's it. Now, if you, if you want to swing him, you can swing him. But if you don't want to swing him, you keep him there. Ah! Uh, okay. That's what happens. All right. Now let's take the other side view, and we we'll close with that. All right. Wrap again. Take your firm stand. Bring the hand down. Cross it to where he said, see the, the side of the ear, the side of the neck, back of the neck, side, both sides, clench uh. together, lock, pressing down, uh. press down, uh. and you want to swing, you can swing. If you do not free him, he will choke. He will choke. The more you are sinking down, the more he's choking. The more you are sinking down, the more he's choking. So at the point you now want to free him, you sink down to the last and you bring him out. Alright. Okay. I we are going to stop here for today. At least let's make do with those three points. You still have more of them to stop. For the people that are watching for the very first time, please subscribe, hit the bell as you wait your comment, I wait, I wait your comment, and also so that you can get our updates first hand, because we do updates almost on daily basis. So you will get more of this as you follow us up. Thank you for our already subscribers. Thumbs up. <laughs>